the Swansea last week about putting some pressure on Tottenham. But looking at the table, it looks like Liverpool are more vulnerable now in terms of possibly dropping out of the top four if they lose the game against you and you win your game in hand. How much of an opportunity is this for Chelsea? Yeah, <laughs> this uh, could be a good opportunity for uh, for us. And, uh, but uh, I said, uh, as I said uh, a lot of time uh, in the last uh, three games, uh, if we want to uh, to keep uh, the up alive, uh, we have to win. We have to get three points. And uh, as you know very well, uh, Liverpool is uh, is a good team and. Uh, um, it won't be easy, but uh, if we want to keep alive uh, uh, the hope, and uh, we have to try to, to win to get three points tomorrow, uh, on Sunday. What did you make of Liverpool in the two games against uh, Rome? I mean, obviously their, their attack is very dangerous, but you must feel that you can uh, cause some trouble to their defence. About the fans? No, to um, trouble the defence. Ah, the defence, OK. Yeah, so the fans, beat, yeah. the, okay. beat their defence. <laughs> yeah. Uh, defence. Yeah, for sure we must pay great attention. A great, a great attention. And uh, especially the first game against Rome, uh, this game showed that uh, if you give, uh, you, give it, you give them a lot of space behind the defensive line, uh, they are very dangerous. And... Uh, um, you can have a lot of trouble during the game. They have three, uh, three uh, uh, special players, Mane, Firmino and Salah. Uh, they are very good uh, to, to attack the space and uh, we must pay great attention uh, defensively. Uh, we must be very compact and uh, to prepare the game in the right way. You'll know Mo Salah from when he played in Italy for a few seasons with Roma and Fiorentina, did you believe that he could come back to the Premier League and become a world-class player? Uh, I think I think this season for uh, for uh, for Salah is a fantastic season, and uh, for sure we are talking about uh, uh, a really good player. And uh, uh, I knew him uh, uh, when he played in Italy, but. Uh, to wait uh, uh, this type of season, um, yeah, uh, it would be very difficult to predict this uh, this type of season for uh, for for Sarah. And uh, we are talking uh, about uh, a player with uh, with specific characteristic, uh, good uh, good technical and uh, and also very fast. But uh, in this season, I'm seeing very clinical. And uh, every opportunity, every chance that uh, he he has, uh, and uh, it's very good to to take uh, the opportunity, the chance. You must be disappointed though that he isn't at this club. I mean, you were you just taken over at Chelsea when he moved to Roma permanently. Did you have any influence over that decision to let him go permanently? My decision. I said, did you have any influence over that? No, decision? no, no. <laughs> I I have never spoke about uh, spoken about uh, about Salah because I think that uh, uh, the situation uh, was clear uh, uh, was very very clear and uh, no one asked me about about him no no and I don't want to take this responsibility <laughs> yeah I have uh, a lot of responsibility if you put also this uh, and uh, I, I, I'm in trouble no and to take the responsibility who has to take the responsibility okay since I think April 21st <laughs> Liverpool have played four matches including two big emotionally draining Champions League semi-finals and you've only played two games do you expect that to have a bearing going into this game do you think that will influence the outcome I think I think uh, uh, for sure they, they want to finish this uh, this season in the best possible way. Also because they have to play uh, two two games to go. Uh, I don't think I don't think uh, um, the game in Champions League uh, uh, could influence uh, in uh, to Liverpool. You've been strongly linked with Manchester United's 
Anthony Martial for next season. Are there any truth in those reports? Uh, I think I think this is not the right moment uh, to speak about this uh, uh, because, uh, as you know very well, I don't like to talk about players of other teams. Uh, uh, this is not uh, this uh, disrespectful uh, for the other players, for my players, and uh, for the other clubs. Yeah, and uh, uh, our focus uh, is on to, to finish this season in the best possible way. If you finish. <coughs> in the top four this season and win the FA Cup. Will that make it more difficult for you and Chelsea to part company this summer, if that's what's going to happen? Uh, I, I think I think that uh, uh, now our our target, our focus uh, is on to, to finish in the possible way and uh, to try to uh, to fight for, for a place in Champions League. It won't be easy because, as you know very well, the situation is not in our hands. But we had to try, we had to try, and the only way that we have uh, to, to start to get three points with, uh, with, uh, with the Liverpool. Uh, and, uh, and then, uh, then I will see uh, uh, what happened. Uh, we have another uh, uh, final in, uh, in FA Cup, and uh, for sure we want to, to, to give a uh, 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 a satisfaction to, to our fans. It won't be easy against uh, Manchester United, but we want to, to try to do our uh, our best uh, until the end. Just away from Chelsea for a moment, Steven Gerrard looks like he's taking the the job at Glasgow Rangers. What advice would you give uh, a player like that taking such a big job so early in his career? Mm, yeah, but uh, I, I don't know. I don't know if this is a, uh, this is a rumor or if uh, uh, he assigned for, uh, for Rangers. Uh, uh, I think that we are talking about uh, a fantastic player. He has started uh, um, since one year no? to, to start uh, to, uh, to be coaching. And uh, yeah, could be a, a fantastic opportunity for, uh, for for him. But I repeat, we are talking about a rumor now, and uh, I think it's not right to to tell something uh, uh, about a rumor. Just finally, from me, um, your reaction to Roberto Mancini getting the Italy national job? But I think this is another another rumor, and. Uh, 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 last week, uh, 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 these rumors uh, was uh, for Car Carlo Ancelotti, and this week uh, is for Roberto Mancini. But I think uh, in this period, uh, this is the period uh, where you uh, you can listen a lot of of, of rumors. We are talking about uh, two uh, uh, two great and uh, experienced manager, and uh, but we'll see what uh, what happened. John. Antonio, after Wednesday night, is it a good time to play Liverpool, would you say, now, or a bad time? How difficult is it to come from such an emotional high to then come back and play in a Premier League game? I don't know. I don't know if this is the right moment to, to play against uh, against them. Uh, for sure, when you play against Liverpool, uh, your expectation to have a tough game. And for this reason, uh, you must be ready to fight. Uh, you must be prepared. Uh, to play against uh, against them, uh, as you know very well, uh, for us it's very important uh, to try to to play a good game and to try to get uh, uh, to get three points um, to keep alive uh, 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 the hope uh, to take a place in Champions League. Uh, but uh, we are ready. We are ready to play against them. Given what they've done in the Champions League, are you surprised that they haven't actually challenged Man City this season for the title? Seriously challenged. Uh, uh, given how well they've done in their Champions League competition, yeah. are you surprised that they haven't given Manchester City a harder challenge okay, for the yes. Premier League? Yeah, but uh, as you know very well, uh, uh, when when you play uh, this type of tournament, uh, a trophy is totally different when you play. Uh, the league, the league, you have uh, 38 uh, games to show that uh, you are the best. And uh, instead, uh, in the trophy, uh, for example, in FA Cup competition, uh, in Carabao competition, Champions League, Europa League competition, and uh, uh, 
It's different. It's different because uh, it's important the moment that uh, uh, that we arrive to play this uh, this game, uh, the physical condition, uh, um, the draw, the draw uh, during your path. But I think Liverpool has deserved to uh, to play this final also because uh, they. Uh, <coughs> They have eliminated uh, Manchester City, and uh, yeah, they they have the seven to to play the uh, the final. As was mentioned a moment ago, there, there is a lot of speculation about your future, about whether you'll be here next season. So, what what is your what is your opinion on that? What's your view about about it? Have you spoken to the board about next season? No, but my my opinion, my opinion, I think that. Uh, uh, you are asking my opinion uh, since uh, the first game uh, uh, in this season after uh, a Burnley defeat. Uh, you are uh, you are continuing to ask me, which is my opinion about my future. I think that uh, it's very strange to have uh, one season <laughs> with the same question in every in every press conference. But despite this, uh, uh, my my answer. Uh, uh, it's always the the same, and uh, uh, I have a contract with Chelsea, and uh, I'm doing my job, and I'm doing uh, my my work uh, every day, and uh, this is my this is my answer. Okay, last one, Nizam. Well. Hi, Antonio. Um, you've got like quite a big uh, squad at this club, and there's lots of players trying to fight for the World Cup. Uh, if you lose to Liverpool, will you try to help maybe guys like? Ross Barkley and Danny Drinkwater get into a World Cup squad for England or a different country? Oh, I don't know, I don't know. Oh, yeah, I think I think when when you arrive at this point of the uh, the season uh, uh, doesn't change if you play one, two, three games. I think that uh, the coach as very clear in his mind, uh, uh, which are his, uh, his decision. And uh, I repeat, now we have to try to to help uh, before to help Chelsea. And, yeah, to try to uh, uh, to finish this uh, this season in the best possible way, and then uh, and then uh, uh, we'll see we'll see uh, which are the. Uh, um, <coughs> They call about uh, uh, about the, nas the national team. Will you feel sorry for some of these guys who maybe miss out because you know other guys have taken their place and got the got the spots in the starting eleven? Mm. Will you feel sorry for the, those players that don't go because other players will go? That's it. That's it. Will you feel sympathy or not? Are you have to tell them sorry? No. <laughs> will you feel will you feel sympathy if they can't go? Ah yeah, but but for sure for sure I I, I feel uh, sympathy for uh, for for my players. But <laughs> and then uh, as you know very well, uh, um, before this big competition, uh, the, the coach has to to pe pick pick up the the best the best players uh, that uh, during this season they show it to deserve to 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 play this uh, this tournament. But for sure. Uh, I have great sympathy for uh, for my players, and I hope to to see uh, many Chelsea players uh, in this tournament.